Hey, welcome back again with new video, guys. This is Sampath. You're watching Sampath Samfx YouTube channel, and this is me, 11x or the Redmi K40 or the Poco F3 custom ROM reviews. Back with Cherish OS, guys, and Android version is 14. Latest security patch is here, as you can see, February 5, 2024. Build date is also February 13. Latest one kernel user is 4.19.246. No kernel has been used. Selling status is enforcing, and this is typical home screen and wallpaper what we get. And these are the quick settings toggles. In the edit section, you also get some more, as you can see. For some reason, Dolby Atmos is not given here. Anyhow, we'll enable this uh, FPS information on the left side corner. You will see. And this is typical home screen. If I press and hold here, you get this wallpaper sense style. And this is the lock screen customization what we can check out from Android 13 to 14 this is the only visual change what we can get I have kept on telling this and regarding the home screen you get more wallpapers here as you can see it's getting reloaded you can also see the real time FPS here on the top left corner as you can see this is the wallpapers AI wallpapers are also given here Android 14 and this is the wallpapers themed icons has been given app grid up to uh, 5 into 5 is given that's it here as you can see this is the themed icons only in the home screen if i can press and hold here you also get widgets that's quite normal here nothing new anything like that you get all the widgets home settings again it's a pixel launcher search preferences you can allocate some of them and at a glance again there are plenty of options as you can see these things you can customize actually once you use start using that dialer again very simple here google dialer you will get call recording but it will announce the other person that you have recorded the call as you can see that's how it is it's simple thing and the camera application again here you get MIUI Leica integrated and you get 4k 60 option here photo mode portrait mode night mode more yeah this is not a Leica integrated one yeah it is yeah like a vibrant and other just in the portrait photo mode you get uh, this is old kind of options this is not updated yet but you will get all the options as you can see that's how regarding the camera if you want to use any g camper that's going to be fine in my opinion again and regarding this calculator and basic apps are working when haptic feedback strength is fine here stereo speakers are good call calling is fine here otps i am getting received here and this gemini this is the a board uh, whatever the google's a engine this is gemini is potential if you want to install through play store you can do that too let's see the uh, this one redirect test of the memories here and if you're first time to this channel hit that subscribe button down below guys and also allow the bell notification by pressing the bell icon and if you like the video give it a like guys and i'll be motivated to make similar kind of videos by the way you can check out the read write test of here and also random read write test you guys can see with graph and numericals you can see here it's getting done here yet yeah these are the results what we can achieve from this particular app it's quite similar you can check out my previous videos again and previous version of cherish OS is also fine here DRM information again HDR support is there level 1 certified no need to worry regarding that safety net status also get past both the things you can use payment applications everything going to work fine no problem regarding that too in terms of results benchmark results you can also check out the app opening time here slightly the lower scores as you can see seven lakh seven thousand nine hundred seventy two is the score what i got and 3.2 degree celsius of temperature has been dropped and four percentage of battery has been dropped during this testing of n2 benchmark results here and regarding this one geekbench if i can show you the history yeah you guys can see 1138 is a single score 3116 is a multi score linux 4.19246 no kernel has been used and our version is 14 again these are the benchmark results what i got and you also get this wiper fx once you connect a bluetooth headset it will automatically detect whatever you need to tweak you can tweak from here this is a version what we can get from this particular rom guys and 
yeah play store certification has been done google maps google uh, pay everything is working fine no need to worry regarding that settings panel again will close this yeah now we'll go settings from here also you can go from here also this power button is also a little bit animated and you get some other options advanced restart button no it's getting busy however you can check out the cherish logo guys in some of the videos i unable to show that here you got it and this is a fingerprint unlock and face unlock will be set down already and this is the settings panel what i was speaking you guys can see search icon get some animation here and these are arranged in terms of tiles here status bar again you get plenty of customizations here quick settings toggles themes you can check out my previous video regarding these things buttons animations is still not done lock screen power menu advanced restart button here i need to enable now you can check out here in order to reboot now you can directly reboot into recovery using this these are the customizable settings which are known as cherry settings now going to actual settings here battery usage you can see the animation and battery usage you can see the idle drain is very minimal what i can say and these are the apps what i'm using battery saver is there extreme battery saver is still available here in some of the roms you don't get this options in cherry choice it's available charging control if enable that you get again modes here thermal profiles you can adjust for example this is a benchmark keep it benchmark like that you can customize them battery optimization is there and battery temperature and battery battery diagnostics also is there here these are battery settings i'm going to sound and vibration again here also you get a uh, why this one animation vibration and haptic feedback strength you can actually adjust as you can see you can choose the patterns from here and direct sound settings are simply missing in this particular rom guys wallpaper sound style i already shown this display settings again adaptive brightness extra dim features screen out dark theme let's check this out if i can use the pitch black condition here yeah vivid colors you need to enable that then it will be in pitch black condition and size and textiles you can adjust that is accessibility you know again colors you can keep it whatever you want live displays there ambient eq is there here minimum maximum low power refresh type up to 120 all the things tap to wake and tap to sleep both are working fine let's check that out tap to sleep only on the status bar no no it's not working tap to wake at least yeah it is working let's check yeah tap to wake is fine here as you can see this ambient display what we can get in this particular room we'll go into settings back here and the security and privacy again face unlock fingerprint unlock has been given and app lock is also pre-installed no need to worry regarding that no need to install any third party application into system again you get an updater here you guys can see and gestures into the gesture navigation mode into settings you can even adjust the pill length also also the pill radius you can completely hide the gesture bar also from here that's fine in my opinion and there are no Dirac sound settings that's simply missing here apart from that everything is fine here as you can see scrolling between apps and moving between apps and zooming in zooming out everything is fine here i haven't faced any issues here i want to show some screenshots i took yeah during charging many actually i took for example starting it will show like this turbo charging 11 watts it will gradually increase to 14 watts and again it will show like this the time you can check out here 1228 it was 47 percent and 1254 it's already 93 percent that's how the charging speeds what we get in this particular rom guys no one will show these things in any of the videos i'm showing that for that at least i will get a like i think so let's see bjmi how it handles in this particular room here basically you get 60 fps support as you can see as you can see smooth plus extreme is given hdr extreme are also given here but i will recommend to go with smooth plus extreme itself because battery life is also very important but if you want to record videos in high quality then you can use that take some different guns here yeah. there was some lag what i have noticed this is not going to be any gaming room or anything like that guys those are different it was difficult for me to take that kind of kill anyhow
now it's fine even in counter attacks it was fine actually and uh, this is how the quick settings toggles what you can see and this is the real time fps you guys can see and if any notifications appear it will be down underneath that you guys can see no notifications and volume panel again this is how it looks i like guys a little bit here yeah. if you enable gyroscope and all it will work no need to worry That's how it is guys. We'll come back here. That was interesting. Let me continue. Yeah, now I'll come back here. That's how the experience what we can get in this particular ROM guys. Cherish was 5.3. It is smooth, definitely. The UI is really, really smooth. The game experience is fine. I can't say it's the best, but it is fine. Even in quick settings toggles, it is smooth enough. You can definitely try it out as a daily driver, guys. And you can check out my Evolution X. It's very similar to this particular ROM. Find out the differences and flash according to that, guys. Check out my videos, other videos also. HyperOS videos are also live in my channel. If you're still not subscribed, subscribe to my YouTube channel. This is Sampath signing off, guys. We'll meet you with another interesting video. Until that, keep smiling. Bye bye for now.